Okay, hey YouTubers and YouTubians. I would like to show you examples or anything of taxidermy. This is going to be my own little YouTube thing for taxidermy and other animal associated products. And here we go. This is a squirrel I did by myself. Uh, it's just a normal squirrel. It's a wall hanger. Goes up just like that. Just like that. And as you can see, I put leaves on the side and going up top to make it look like a more special effects, you know, to make it look real. I put moss growing on the stump and moss going all around the squirrel. That's the moss is for looks and it could also s cover up any screws or anything you have in there. And then if you see any cracks or unwanted things that you want people to see, just put moss there. What we use at the taxidermist, we use a type of spray adhesive, basically spray glue. I've got some, a leaf coming down here. Remember, do not use too much and do not use too little. So, put moss way over there, coming down here. And if you have these little stumps, do not put too much moss on the ground or the bottom because remember, Moisture and stuff don't usually get underneath there. And going on the back, on the back we just have two pieces of wood to make it flat, so it'll go against the frame of the uh, or the wall. There's a little squirrel. Doesn't matter on the back because it don't matter. Right here, just get like a bandsaw or something to cover up those or to make it more spiky, like you cut it or something. Now the bottom is just a flat surface, it don't matter. And that's about it for the squirrel. I'm going to put clay in the ears to make it stay up, like I have right there, but like take off the clay after it dries up. Next, we have a coyote. It's just a regular old skinned out coyote. Cut up the butt. And, yeah, it's tan and everything. Nice little tail. Going up here. You know, just regular old pelt. Yeah, my dog's chewed up the nose, so it, like, ripped off. Here's a mink. I actually just bought this today. I didn't skin it out or anything. Got it for about ten bucks over at the swap meet. Uh, and just a little piece of elk I found over at the texture mist. Uh, if your elk hide is really hard, all you have to do is spray, just drown it with WD-40 and fold it up. Leave it outside for the night or anywhere. You don't really want all that toxins in your house and better put it outside. And by morning it should be more softer. Get one of those little shavers with teeth in it. Uh, some video I'll show show you what it looks like, and it should become a lot more softer, and you can basically make anything out of it. And that's about it. Here, show you my school ID. Look at that, pretty hot, huh? That's just my lunch card. Don't worry. And so that's about it. See you later and peace. I have more videos you can see. Go watch them if you want to see me or if you want to hear my beautiful voice still more.